Tracking some light showers that continue to push across mid-Missouri this evening, finally moving out of the area by the time you get to about midnight this evening. But we are left with cloudy skies, keeping our temperatures still right around or just under 50 degrees. We get down to 50 in Moberly, Boonville, California, and Columbia down to about 49 by morning with that cloud cover sticking around through much of the day. That should keep our temperatures a little cooler along with a northwest breeze tomorrow. We see temperatures only making it up to about 65 by 3 o'clock. Clouds start to clear out by tomorrow night, though as winds continue to hold on. We're going to see those gusts up to around 20 to 25 miles per hour, especially during the day tomorrow. And once those skies clear, we'll start to see the winds die down just a little bit into Friday. Here's what to expect. Our ABC 17 storm track Doppler radar showing where we're seeing the effects of this cold front, those showers stretching from Michigan all the way back into Kansas across mid-Missouri as well tonight. Here's what our ABC 17 storm track future track looks like overnight. Here's midnight. We'll start there with the rain off to our east. A couple spotty showers possible for some of our northern counties as that low pressure spins across portions of the Great Lakes into tonight. That cloud cover still sticks around tomorrow, keeping us just a touch warmer in the morning. But the afternoon will be a little cooler than today as we won't see sunshine at least until early evening. That breeze will continue into the evening as clouds finally clear up by Friday morning. We are left slightly cooler temperatures in the 40s to start off, but the afternoon looks perfect to get outside. We're going to see temperatures in the low 70s on Friday and then on Saturday, we'll start out near 50 degrees in the morning, warming up into the low 70s. So here's our homecoming kickoff forecast in Columbia on Saturday. We should be around 73 by kickoff and will hold into the 60s even as the sun starts to go down in the evening. So it's going to be comfortable. The rest of the weekend, I'll be tracking slightly cooler temperatures on Sunday with highs in the upper 60s, perhaps some increasing clouds ahead of a chance for a few showers at nighttime. But outside of that, we are dry over the weekend. It's mild heading into early next week, but we'll be tracking our next chance of rain potentially by Wednesday.